Hello YouTube fans, here again and the test of news just coming to bid raise apart from the day in the shop, the day we had a power cut we had a power cut and because of that we didn't make as much of what we normally do but you know it was a power cut, things like this happen but there's some good news Boris the Blumberer, that means Boris Blumberer in Donsford will see the errors of his rays. As we know, we've got an after vaccine passport, we're going to have it on our phone, so it's every bar, restaurant, nightclub, sex bar, whatever, just to get an enter there, to get in. Been stopped. We already know in other countries it's been stopped. The lockdown, what we were supposed to get in October, been stopped. Hooray! There's a dot after it all. But this one's the one I love the most. Boris the Blumber, with that big sturdy paper that he could shut this place down, he could shut your business down, you're not allowed to go and have jafferings, there goes the oddly I was looking forward to, there goes a bit of dogging I couldn't wait to do. And all that, he's now decided to stop it, because he's finally fucking found out defeat. Away, a medical. Boris, I never thought, I never thought in a million years I'd see a brain in your head. I never thought of it. Because in all fair said and done, it's an epidemic. Looking down a business and watching people's business go down under, and I'm not talking about us, I'll get to them in a minute. Um, and chipping the economy and us sitting on our boat wasting so many months isn't going to change the bloody thing because it's an epidemic you know what i mean when i cough no i haven't got the virus got something stuck in my throat but what i'm getting at is it's an epidemic nothing you can do shutting the doors locking the boat well locking the board just would have been the biggest help for it, so we'll get to that one but Locking your door, not going out, living like a hermit is not going to get rid of it. Passport, don't do bugger at all. You just do pass it on. Just that it's not as passable if you had two pricks and you let somebody else have had two pricks. But you're still going to get it. See what I mean? See what I mean? And Australia. Australia, I apologised for being a dick the other week. See? Even I could be a man sometimes when I'm in the wrong. Right? I'm being a man. Because the reason why I'm being a little bit lenient on us, eh? even though I do think the specky for I deke, we run into fucking don't worry the world on mast and drop that back. I apologise a little bit because they've also found out defeat. Because what I mean by that is they now have turned around and said they've got to learn to lift with it. Lockdown is not the answer. Doesn't get rid of the body man meaning the fires, doesn't get rid of it. So they turned around and said, we got to learn to live with it, you know. we got to learn to live with it. Away. And Boris, away, at last. Boris has got a brain. I don't know anymore to see if he's got one. Because he's now decided to stop that fucking thing, what he was going to have, into bloody marks. He's decided to stop it. Away. At last, Boris. I never thought in a million years to thank you for finding a figging brain. It's the same, it was a bit late that you didn't shut the bloody board off and use your bloody brain. But I'm happy. The idea has been stopped that at the end of the day, he was going to bring out a law, people. Remember me saying that? He was going to bring out a law that if he weren't happy and it was going up, he could shut down your livelihood. He was going to bring out a law that he wasn't going to let you be sociable chafferings, even though nightclubs and bars are open. Right? Even though he's going to bring a passport out, again, being stopped, and he's going to bring out all these fucking barbaric laws. I wouldn't say barbaric. I wouldn't say barbaric. At the end of the day, it's like you're being punished for a flipping epidemic. You're not going to get rid of the body man. So you're fighting people, but you're not going to get rid of it. You shut borders up, doesn't work. All you're doing is killing the figging economy, shutting down businesses. I've said it from day one, we make our shop safe. Yes, we now got the option of wearing a mask or not. When you sign it, it's the time to use the dilt tip. Did it work? Did wearing a mask work? People want to 
type up now say you're out of order you're this you're that did it work did it bring down the r weight the lockdown did it work you reopen things it come up again it come up again but there's a bit what proves that lockdowns didn't work the other week i looked at fear mongering news why not i'm naming same one because they like fucking making things darker and suppressed and it said that every popular was eye up again bullshit and i will say bullshit because i checked it out on saturday and the arrow that right arrow was going down it was going down again even james i went down and yes i admit i got a boner because it was good to see our arrow going down this to death Guess what, people? Everyone that lives in Tameside, you'd be able to know that right arrow was going down again. So even though the red one was going up, going up, we was also going down. But should I get excited today? Should I go, yay, today? No, because for I know, we could be going up. But that's what it's been like, people. This is what it's been like for the past few freaking week. It's been going up and down, up and down, up and down like a freaking Lolo. Even the deaths. And I would never raise a death on anyone. If you think I'm a trolled heartless bastard, no I'm not. But in all fairness, people, people die of cancer. People have heart illnesses. People die every day. Whether it's old AIDS, whether it's, it's fucking cancer, whether somebody gets run over by a car. People die every day. So it'd be a barrel of bad news, people. So it'd be an arsehole. But I'm just saying, I'm being a realist, right? The death rate, did this to death, was the lowest it's been. I wish it was no deaths, just so I've got some humanity people. But in all fair said and done, there's an illness that if you're weak, you've got a weak addition, or you're an old person, or you have very health problems, if you get the virus, you're a goner. I'm not fighting you, being realistic. That's why the fat scene works. And if people say, well, I'm not having the fat scene, and my mates ain't going to have it neither, and you don't have it, don't have my sympathy because you choose to do that. That's your option, right? Not being an asshole, being realistic. So, yeah, so many people died, but it was the shortest compared to the past few weeks. I'm not saying it's result because I didn't, I, did you not hear me? Rewind back. I do not wish anyone to die. Just so I'm not a cold, heartless bastard. But so many, being realistic, had died that the freaking news was too Armageddon. There was too fucking Armageddon. That is a result when so many are, yeah, but again, it's up and down, up and down. Doesn't tell you that. Fear Monger News just says, oh, it's going up, it's going up. It's going up and down. Scientists, she's witties, and all you other scientists but keep saying it's going up. It is going up and down. What is wrong with you? Why are you suffering fear? But I'm happy in one way. Today, yeah, we didn't do that, dud. But that's not a fault of ours. That's not Coronas. That is called a power cut. We had a power cut. Let's we got the letter on now. I thought there goes the business because the till wasn't working, but the guy would come in to fix it. Did a demo fix it? I'm not in a naughty way. He fixed it. And um, that was the only reason. Sunday, we did beautiful. Sunday, we made what? 260. 260. That's been the best we've ever had on a Sunday. So people now are like are finally waking up. They're finally realising that the big bad sturdy man, the big bad boldy man, which is called Carver, finally Bolish, you're learning from Osse. Bolish and everyone else who is scared of the boldy man, we need to learn to live with it. And then said it, it will burn its way out. It will burn its way out. And then said it will get a stunt immunity. Think about it. How many times has it gone up and down? Ignore your fucking scientists, that is good fear facts. Ignore your fucking news, because that's all they'll ever do is if you doom and doom. Learn to live with it. It is a virus what is more dangerous if you're fat fuck. It is a virus what is more dangerous if you've got elf thistles. And it is a virus what is more deadly for the old left. Right? If I got it, then I'll feel like I'm dying. But I probably have to spend day, 10 bloody days in bed. But it's not going to kill me. Same as anyone else. Just your fear mongering news and your government don't see that. But there's your answer. 
It's gone down the past few weeks, people, and I'm happy that Boris has finally seen the error of his ways. But should I get my hopes up? Should I? To be continued at another later date, if it ever does. But until then, be smart, be safe, and I'm happy we get some normality. A little bit. But until then, see you later.